Thanks for tuning in to another segment on the Elm Sports Network. I'm joined with the field hockey head coach, Annie Keatsman, uh, before they head out to McDaniel tonight for a 7 p.m. game. Before we touch on McDaniel, uh, we haven't caught up with you in a couple weeks, so let's just briefly talk about uh, the team's record and, and progress you've seen so far. 4-5 and five overall and 2-1 and one in conference play. Uh, what have you seen from the girls so far, especially in conference play? Yeah, I think um, I've been really happy with how they show up for conference games. Um, you know, we ran into a really tough Hopkins team. Um, and so I think we – I was happy with our ability to execute. We had six shots on goal and two of those went in. And so f- to see the stuff we've been working on in practice, taking advantage of opportunities, especially on fast breaks, um, which we knew would be the bulk of our opportunities against a team like Hopkins, to see those pay off was really neat. Um, and Hopkins plays a really smart – Uh, tactical style and so I think we responded well to making adjustments kind of mid-game and that's really the first time we've had to do that so I think as much as it was a loss we learned a lot from that game and just in general we played a pretty tough out of conference uh, schedule and so sometimes when I hear four and five I'm like ooh, but I'm also like well we challenged ourselves we played really good teams and I think we did so much learning Um, you know now the first half of the season is behind us and we head into I think pretty much every game except for Roanoke is a conference game and those are the ones that matter so I think kind of the messaging has been like we need to learn these lessons now and we might be losing some battles, but we're winning the war because our ultimate goal is conference success. Um, And so they seem pretty focused on that message. And I think they're really ready to take on McDaniel. And then next week we have two more big ones with SWAT and Dickinson. Mm -hmm. Um, And it's just our conference is so competitive. And this year it's really been cracked wide open. So I think we're excited to kind of take our our piece uh, this year. All right, great coach. Uh, let's shift over to you coaching. Again, the first year as head coach. Uh, in the first couple games and the first part of the season, like you were saying, how have you embraced the opportunity coaching here? Yeah, I think we're trying to take it one day at a time, and we've been talking actually recently about kind of being in the moment, and I think even for me it's important to, to keep – some perspective and you know sometimes it's we have these really big games on the horizon and it's like okay like we have to play this one and we have to still yeah and take care of our stuff um and so keeping everything in perspective and I'm really lucky that I have a really great staff um so Taylor and Amanda Bramble um they're both at practice every day and they add a lot of uh, depth to our staff and so I've been able to rely on them a lot this season and a lot more as we get deeper into the season, um, which has been great because it's just more people with a lot of hockey knowledge making an impact on the team. All right, last one, then we'll let you go get ready for McDaniel. Uh, let's preview McDaniel, 7 p.m. tonight. Uh, from studying them, what have you seen and how can you guys come out to win? What, like, what are the important factors tonight? Yeah, I think for us, um, it's going to be executing a lot of our hockey style so there's stuff that like we've been working on in practice and if we can find a way to translate that into into the game so transitioning the ball out of our backfield to create scoring opportunities um, sustaining possession on the attack Um, I think that'll be key for us McDaniel's always tough Mm -hmm. Um, they're definitely a hard-working team um, and they'll they give pretty much everybody a a run so I think it's going to be us staying composed uh, because they play a tough style, they're really aggressive. Um, they're going to be all over us, and so we need to stay composed and remember that we just need to execute our game plan. All right, Coach. Thank you, and hey, good luck. Thanks for uh, sitting down with us before a busy day. Thanks. Yeah.